What's happening, everybody? My name is Alex. You can call me Alpha Zip Anime. And guys, today we're back for a brand new reaction, a brand new video. We're about to get right on into it. Today we're watching episode 10 of our Naruto Supreme Watch Show, guys. Last episode, we saw that uh, Baki, he went to go uh, see the honored siblings over Gara being taken away by, apparently, her grandson. Her grandson is Sasori. How wild is that? Uh, I don't know how they found out about the Ikatsuki, because it seemed like they were, like, locked inside this place. Because when Baki was walking up to the building they're in, it had the big block blocked the door from being opened it was on the outside of the building so i don't know why they're being kept inside that's really weird to me apparently they knew all about the akatsuki all about the uh the sand spirit which they call shikaku i guess and then we got to also see that naruto had some serious feelings about them wanting to kill gara telling tamari he was like no we will get gara back and you know stuff like this and sakura is like oh naruto she was looking back like to the times where she remembered when naruto was treated badly as a kid so you know it's kind of cool to see the the side of this where everyone's really starting to Realize, man, he really got treated bad as a kid. Now we all like look to him for help. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, Naruto's really starting to get emotional. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you aren't subscribed already. I love all the support. Go check out my Patreon link. That's where we post the full unedited episodes and we put them up on Patreon a week ahead of my YouTube schedule. Put a comment down below. No spoilers in the comment section, please. And throw a like on this video. That being said, guys, let's hop right into it. All right. Episode 10. Is my volume on? Okay, they were just being super quiet. Ah, oh, so they came out to play. I guess her finding out that it was her grandson helped out a lot. Uh, I guess they're going to Conqueror's operating room. Lady Chio and Lord Abiso, older brother of the Kazukage. Oh, Those older brother of the Kazukage. Has he seen them before? Oh, she's probably going to be able to help out with this poison then. Never, seen this. Never mind. <laughs> oh, man. We tried everything we have. Far nothing's had any noticeable effect. Because he knew that they wouldn't be able to cure him. So why would they go to her for help? I mean, I know... So she's an old woman, but she must have something going on if they're willing to go for her for help. Like if they think that they could, uh, that she could help get him back. Feels good to be leaving the sand behind. Like keeping people waiting. This dude's like a broken record. And we'll go ahead and skip this. For those of you who are not in the Jonin tier of my Patreon, I did do a reaction to that song and it's posted on the Jonin tier. So if you are interested in hearing that, go sign up for that one. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, she popped the bottle. Well, she about to come up with something. It's me in the kitchen. <laughs> I finished the recipe. I'm like, hmm, that wasn't delicious either. What? And you know what? They told him that. He said, no, don't go out there. This, you're not going to be able to take them. I'll tell you what, though. You don't know who Naruto is, lady. Oh, I didn't see Naruto. Did he go ahead of them? Naruto. Right up there. Oh, okay. Did he not sleep? You have to get some rest, bro. You're gonna get there and not be able to do anything because you're so tired and your energy drained from traveling One nonstop. Day, do we really have to hurry? Oh yeah, they're gonna get there like right when Conqueror is running out of time. Okay. And she doesn't even know uh, Tamari. She doesn't even know that Conqueror is like in really bad shape right now. This one's beyond even me. He has a day at best. Sounds like your grandson is smarter than you with these poisons. Sasori's outdone himself this time. There's one who's more versed in antidotes than I. Old Queen of Slugs, Tsunade. Oh, see, everyone recognized Tsunade. Growing up with antidotes for every kind of poison I could throw. Lady Tsunade is now Hokage, I believe. Takes three days to travel here from Belief. There has to be a faster way. Suggesting we summon her here. Why? She ever did? Hello, she sneezed. That happened in Naruto when uh. Who was it that was talking oh, about him? Right. Jiraiya, maybe? There's I can't remember. Kakashi left two days ago. All goes well. They should be there tomorrow morning. <gasps> That's a bad sign. That is a bad sign. Oh, Wait, so what happened to the Leaf Village? I won. Oh, yeah. If she wins, it's not good. Bad omen. Because remember, that happened when uh, she kept on here. winning the jackpot when Orochimaru was uh, going to find her. I finally reached the desert. But what does this mean? The village, it's best if I take the lead from here on out. What was that smile for? Oh, so they actually do have a hideout. Oh, you know, I was kind of wondering where they were headed to. Let's go. I still don't think that's Gara. Actually, I don't know. I don't think they would have drugged that on this long. 
not not the Ikatsuki, but the the writers of the show. I don't think they would have let us on for this long. That that is Gara, or th if that wasn't Gara, you know. But maybe it maybe it actually is Gara's body. And plus, I think he would he would have popped up by now in the village, you know. What was that? I'm confused. It's like a hologram. Okay, so Gara is the Jinchuriki. Okay, so a Jinchuriki is someone that has a demon inside of them. Wait, so is he actually physically there? Like, is that like what his body actually looks like? That doesn't make any sense. That's a hell of a summon. <laughs> I'm confused. Let everyone gather. Some weird eyes. So he just like summons like a giant monument? Shall we begin? So they all gather. Okay, so that dude's not physically there. I guess they all just meet like in holograph mode? Oh wow, those are all body bags. We've managed to recover the remains of all of our casualties. We haven't been able to find Captain Yuda. There's no trace of him. Not a scrap of clothing, nothing. Quickly put together a backup squad and send them after me. It's not yeah, where did, did he go? Him? We have to send reinforcements to the Sand Village at once. One team that must be done with their mission by now. Oh, do you mean... Yes, milady, I'll see to it. Who is it? Man, now I'm curious. Come on. It will now take three days and so is the, well. the monument, like, alive? Three and days and nights. Have your physical body stand guard outside. Isn't it possible that it might take longer than that to get started at once? That's true. So what are they doing that takes Sounds three days? God, I love this music so much. Oh, he has like green eyes. I wonder if it's like a, a, a Hugo member. If that was like Byakugan or something. Nine Phantom Dragons. Well, that can't be good. So what's gonna happen to him? Sealing Jutsu. I'm so curious on who this is. S-ranked? Really? What? An S rank? You're joking. Oh, it was an accident. You can see it in her face. <laughs> they're they're sensei. That's so funny. He said, you can't be serious. So I'm guessing that means S-rank is like above. Yeah, that's right, because they said uh, everyone in the Akatsuki is an S-rank criminal. That makes sense. That S-rank would be like the highest rank mission. It was all a mistake, thank goodness. I don't think he would survive an S-rank mission. Get to the Sand Village as fast as possible. Who is it? Show us. Yes, Lee. Oh, 10-10, you look so different. Oh my god. Why is everyone sneezing? I feel like this is supposed to symbolize something, all the sneezing. One day. With the speed of you. I love them. She acts like she hasn't seen him in years. I haven't seen Naruto for a long time. Is to see how much he has changed. Oh, I'm so excited. So they're gonna meet him and help him with this mission? Oh, that is awesome. Wait, they're this not at the sand village yet? And we're just sitting here. And relax. There's nothing we can do. If you hit a sandstorm, you stay put. You lose all your sense of direction in a storm like that. Lasts very long. But she has like wind scythe or whatever. Can't right? she just like you know, do the wind and make all the sandstorm go away. We're able to do is ease his pain and try to help him rest. Sasori straight up told him, you know, it would be very miserable. And if they brought an experienced poison specialist, to I mean, Sakura knows medical ninjutsu, but she's she's least not a student, so you know, there's no guarantee that she knows stuff like that. Especially like more than someone experienced like her. Naruto will change that. It's so is she just like playing possum again? I don't know why that was such a like a delayed reaction. <laughs> That's not what I'm talking about. We've been expecting you this way. Can you imagine if Tamari wasn't with them and they got lost in that sandstorm? What? You say they got Konkuro as well? So her brother, both of her brothers are in bad shape right now. She's probably not doing good. Let me take a look at it. Ooh, she got some confidence. But she gonna pull it off. Him. Him. The white fang. Good gosh, she's like. What? 
Whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened? Dude, she was going after Kakashi like she was gonna kill him. And Kakashi, obviously, you could tell, like, he's never even seen this woman. That's what he looked like, at least. Dude, he's sitting there like, yo, why is this lady running to me? And she's like, get ready to defend your life. So the white fang of the leaf? I mean, that is a nickname that suits him. His hair is kind of, you know, it's white and it kind of looks like a fang, I guess. I don't even know what to think about that. But anyways, you know, they, uh, they finally made it to the sand village, guys. So Sakura is gonna say, yeah, let me take a look at his poison, blah, blah, blah. So maybe, maybe she can come up with something honestly i think she will and i think the old lady is gonna be like hmm, okay thank you or she'll just be like super resistant the only thing the old lady's doing right now is wanting to kill kakashi for whatever reason i mean you know kakashi's mr worldwide so you know i mean she has to know him from somewhere something but yeah so i'm glad they're in the village now gara tire akatsuki just showed up all in like hologram mode i'm not sure what that's all about but they summoned like this giant like monument looking thing with like hands and they all started doing the ceiling jutsu on gara's like sealing gara inside the statue or i i honestly have no clue what they're doing or maybe it's a jutsu that's gonna let one of them get in the body because like that's my thought right now uh they're gonna try and move their bodies into the jinchuriki uh that juice same jutsu that like orochimaru uses um that's the only thing i can think of yeah but you know there's only one we're gonna find out and that's to watch next episode uh, i'm probably done uh recording videos for today you know tomorrow i'm gonna hop right in on into uh recording these next few episodes if you aren't subscribed to the youtube channel yet please make sure you hit that red subscribe button it definitely means a lot i love all the support uh go down to patreon if you do want to help support my channel even further patreon is where all my full length uncut episodes are posted a week in advance of youtube drop a comment down below let me know your thoughts on this video and where we're at no spoilers please and don't forget to throw a thumbs up on the video guys if you do enjoy my content and with all that being said i'll see you tomorrow in the next video peace